Mr. Buford's gonna turn up soon, sir. You just wait and see. Anything I can get you, Colonel. Where's Buford? Where can he be? Let me go get you another mint jeweler. Lucinda. Yes, sir? Mm. No, sir. No, I don't. Watch you. They're the only got left. They're the only reason I come home. What am I going to do? Hope, sir. What the hell? Miss Burnham? Daddy, didn't you and Mr. Maitwan? Daddy, didn't you and Mr. Maitwan? Hush, girl. Both you hush. Yeah, my boy's a pal. All you do is spit on wives to him. Stella, you wait here. You believe me, don't you, sister? Yes, I believe you. What Stella saw speaks to the unknown. Treat any crystal ball, girl. My first concern is where Buford is. I'm concerned about Buford, too. But if you seek answers, I know who may help. The thing is, I can't find Walter. Don't you mention that, Yankee. His express purpose in this county is to root out evil. A vile evil. The development behind the evil. Just like that other Yankee who ruined my boy. What do you think you're doing, Daddy? I ain't sitting on my bum no more, little girl. You know, man, Vickers is a blade for this, and that Yankee's done come back a ghost. Surely you're speaking in metaphors. Metaphors, matadors, it don't matter none. Not when my boy's in trouble. What you seek is not here. I leave now. An excellent decision, gentlemen. You can come out now. They've all gone. You've been a naughty girl, Buford. You do remember your name, don't you? You're becoming quite a nuisance, even more so now than as a human. It's only a matter of time before they catch up with you. They'll fire lead bullets into your hide, but lead is useless against you. So, what can destroy you, you ask? Only the metal that wards off what mortals call evil. Silver. The Maya people were the first to discover its power. Don't ask me foolish questions! You know very well why I changed you. That new skin, or shall I say rotted skin, suits you best. 
You're the virus corrupting my people, feeding off their life blood. And yet, when it came time for Buford to be the master of that saloon, did he stand his ground? Did he provoke the Yankee to draw his gun? No, sir. Yankee hatred spared you from swinging in the gallows that day. The same as your ilk was spared for lynching my brethren. <laughs> I hear the Yankee calling you, Buford. <laughs> You. you were only to frighten him. I should I listen to you, witch? Because I am the witch. He shall return. You can't keep a Yankee in the ground for very long. Not so brave, even with your superhuman abilities. Well, I suppose you can take the coward out of the human, but never the human out of the coward. When I summon you next, you will meet me at the Vicar's barnyard. Now go! <laughs> I've read you shine in the Lord's light. I confess you something I never told anybody. Now forgive me if I don't say it to nobody else. I done condemned a man. I ain't got no cause to do it. I just... I just turned scared. I swear my son's life. No more time foolery. If only I can save Buford Mosby's life. Why? Where you been, Charity? You been to talk around plantation now? Why care for the son of a slave owner? I figured it'd be the Christian thing to do. You take this precious moment alone to wish for a Mosby's safety? Your mind thinks of Richard. Why? How did you... Richard's my boy. A father always thinks of his son. Richard's my boy. Whatever Richard has to do with Buford is not my concern. What is important to me is for you to leave my charge. What charge? Our people's charge, out of bondage. You will help organize the rebellion. You, you, you hit your head on a rock or something? Do not shun me, Ben Luce. To do so to be costly to you and to your son, Richard. Who do you think you is? You accept my threat. Your mind shouts it so. So now, the only thing left for us to do is to seal our pact. Take a look at your right hand, Ben. <laughs> Ben Lush, you will obey me. Well, this will be the last full moon you wish to look upon if you do not. For your son Bridget will die by your own hands on the night of the next full Things will get very messy. I expect no less from Vickers. Ah! 
Even if I knew the whereabouts of poor Buford, what would I tell you all? Do you value your life, Mr. Mosby? Man, he looked like a tiger about to jump out of bush. Why do you stare at me so? This is insane! Y'all posit no evidence, merely wild conjecture! Esteemed wife prizes a husband who ties his beast in the shack. When he spends time in the shack, she is to blame. She must act with malice. My God! He suffered from an ailing heart. Go see what that was. I simply removed his ailment. Trench! Who are you? What do you want? I got me a gun. I'll use it. No! to frighten me, Mr. Mosby. You know who the apparitions haunt Yakov County or the grizzly murders? You shut your damn mouth. You're too old to play with kids. Jenny, is that you? I'm afraid to venture a guess. Your mind draws the right conclusion. What the hell is behind this? Someone seeks your reacquaintance. Walter! I thought y'all was lost! Only my memory. For a while. What's happened to poor Cherry? Somehow, some way, Harrymon's empowered her spirit with, with Lilith. But why her? It doesn't make any sense. Why? Because I'm a slave? Is that it? Do you know who possesses you? Lilith is pure. I will not ask for the fragment again. Charity, we only want to help you. What are the promises Arimon and she have made you? They're not going to be honored. The time to act is now, Clayton. Promise has been on. No! Clayton! Silver bullets. She changed them. Right, boys. Go sit down and put that body to the Jesus. up behind me like that for it ain't polite now if it was somebody else I say you got something to say for yourself forget it now 
It ain't so bad you gotta feel shame about it. Well, why you look so glum? I forgive you. Come on now, me and you's gonna go see your daddy. Lucinda Holmes, I got your boy with me. Boy, where you been all day? Best get now. We'll talk in the morning. Oh, he scraped his knee. He ain't nothing bad. Wash your knee out for bed, you hear? Miss Holmes, you ain't supposed to be here. They might think she's a runaway. This is how you spend your nights, Ben? Boozing? No wonder your boy go wandering at night. You're a nice fine lady, Miss Holmes. You ain't got cause to talk to me like you do. I ain't come here to preach to you none, Ben. Come here because I need your help. I need your help, Ben. Help? What you need help for? My charity. Something's wrong. She ain't right none. She needs to be put out her misery. No! 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 Stop. Where are you going? Wait for me.
find a way out of here. And when I do, I'm going to forget all my church and my kind of beautiful. Who is that? Who is that? Who are y'all? My name is Clayton Mosby. Mosby. Mosby Clan of Yakov County.